My name's Eddie and I'm an Urca Master Trainer. I run a lot of uh, Urca courses through Vertex. Um, so I just want to talk you through a bit of what, uh, the assessment sheet and criteria for an Urca Instructor Training course. Um, so the days do vary, so uh, roughly it like, depends on what sort of bolt-ons you do get. If you're going to get um, like a ground-based instructor to uh, like with a low ropes instructor as well. Um, but throughout the week you'll be going through all sorts of different things. It may be like the structure of the set day or the week may depend on the weather importantly because it will be outdoors. So make sure you bring suitable clothing for the whole week. Um, some of the stuff, some of the topics that's on this sheet uh, will be things from routine visual inspections of the structure as well as maybe um, the PP inspections, different types of belay systems and harness systems. Uh, group management, different types of belay devices, and different ways to belay as well, emergency procedures, what, what happens um, if things go wrong and how to manage those and really importantly how to avoid those in the first place. Um, and then the assessment form, so Vertex use a bit of a colour coding system, um, so what we're looking for is maybe you're sort of consciously competent as these skills that stand on this sheet. So just going through um, we talk about pre-use inspections, semi-direct setups, that's the type of ground anchor you're using, PPE fitting, helmet and harness inspection, explanation of activity and the belay system, depending on what you'll be doing, um, teaching of group belaying, supervision of the group belaying, connection of a climber, rope management, belaying competently personally, lowering competently personally, and a belay tie-off securing method. Um, and then the scoring system, one, two, three, and four, but there's also now a T. So that means you've just been trained in that process and not assessed. On the back of this form, we've got a tiny bit more information about what types of harnesses, belay devices, and belay systems that you've got assessed to. This form will be left um, with the in the training venue um, so if you do want a copy you can have those copies um, then this bit of paper will get uploaded into the vertex portal and then added into the urca matrix and then you should get sent through your certificates once you get the green light thank you see you on your training course